hello everyone and welcome to this video in this video i'm going to review the machine learning in r track from data camp so in this video i'm going to explain to you the type of topics that are going to cover in the data camp machine learning in r track and what are those topics and if you should enroll in this track or not let's start this video since we are going to learn machine learning in R so this track should give me at least some courses in R and some theoretical courses in machine learning and then some courses which are combined between machine learning and R so let's see what type of topics or courses should be covered I mean machine learning path or track is basically a bunch of courses in one track so track basically means in bunch of courses they are in a sequence that's which means you take the first course and then you take the second course and the third course and so on so you take them in sequence and you, when you put the whole courses in a sequence you call we call those things track okay so at the beginning since we are going to learn machine learning in R at least at the beginning the track should give me introduction to R course intermediate to our course and advanced to our course most of the time they only give you introduction and intermediate the advanced to R they probably gonna give you to our programmer track they do have something called our programmer track you can check it on my youtube channel so at least give me the intro to R and intermediate to R and then it's going to start analyzing the data in R since we are doing machine learning so we'll be dealing with data and we before we build our models we're going to at least do some data analysis or EDA and do some data visualization and before that we should what I mean we're going to do data analysis and data visualization in R so basically before we take these courses we should know what is an R and know the basic stuff you know like um, uh, vectors v vertices data types and all that stuff and then I'm going to learn data manipulation you know, like deployer package here we have ggplot2 for data visualization the matplotlib and seaborn bouquet are for python and since we're learning machine learning so the math should be covered and the math which are in machine learning are statistics linear algebra calculus and probability so these courses should be covered theor theoretically and then in r and then we're going to start in a core machine learning which is supervised learning and unsupervised learning so supervised learning machine learning algorithms which are like uh, classifications and regression should be covered in R and we have unsupervised learning these algorithms like clustering and anomaly detection and PCA and k-means this should be covered in R also since that come they have their own project section though I don't think they're going to explain Kaggle or Kaggle oh, but it's, it's gonna be nice if they give us at least a course about Kaggle but they do have uh, an entire section called projects I mean after a each course they're gonna give you like an assignment or project but they do have an entire section on their websites called projects where you can just go there and filter let's say R and uh, data uh, EDA for example and it's gonna show you all the projects which are in EDA section but in R language which is very nice you should check the projects review uh, video on my channel and since we're talking about machine learning we're going to learn about artificial neural network so it's going to be very really nice uh, to at least give us an introductory uh, course about deep learning these are nlp and big data i would call them like an additional courses should be covered in machine learning since they are part of machine learning from my point of view if these all are covered in the track uh, it's going to be a uh, very nice track so now let's just go to the data camp website and see if these were covered or not all right so now we are on the website and here we are at the career track of machine learning scientist with R so just like I said in the slide section of this video that since I am learning machine learning with R so this track should teach me at least not at least I mean I'm learning machine learning in R so this track should have introduction 
to R course, intermediate to R course, in, uh, advanced to R course, uh, data visualization in R, uh, intermediate data visualization in R. Uh, it should introduce me to some packages uh, which are used in machine learning in R, like dplyr, tidyverse, ggplot, caret, all these packages. And uh, what else do you should? Okay, machine learning. So at least uh, should uh, give me one intro introductory course about deep learning in R, and then some little bit advanced uh, courses like um, NLP, introduction to NLP in R, introduction to network analysis in R, introduction to big data in R. And obviously, since I'm learning machine learning, it should have some supervised learning and unsupervised learning and some little bit advanced supervised learning and little bit advanced unsupervised learning courses. So let's just go and see by ourselves. This is the track and it has 15 courses, 61 hour. And obviously, it's going to be all our language. If you see that it immediately start with supervised learning in our classification course. And then we have machine learning fundamentals in our assessment, which means after you finish this course, you have to go and uh, assess your skill and see if you understood everything in this course or not, because whatever you're learning here, uh, it's going to be used here. So here we have supervised learning in our classification and regression. So we can see that here the supervised learning was divided into two courses instead of one course which is a really nice which means uh, it's explained in details here since it's in classification obviously it's going to be something like logistic regression decision tree support vector machine this type of algorithms and classification and here we have regression it's going to be linear regression and uh, generalized uh, modules uh, and regression and then we have unsupervised learning in r so we're going to learn about clustering and diamond analysis reduction principle and component analysis and then we have a skill assessment and then you have we have something called machine learning in the tidyverse tidyverse is in a package so we have multiple and logistic regression in r so now we are studying some uh, detailed courses i mean logistic regression was already in the classification r course but it was like uh, a few lessons only or maybe chapter but now here it's in uh, details and you have cluster analysis which is an unsupervised learning and then we have caret which is uh, machine learning package in r and we have tree based models in R, which is an advanced course in, in trees like this is in tree and stuff. Support vector machine has its own course, which is really nice. Advanced dimensional reduction here, we can see some advanced unsupervised learning courses. Fundamentals of Bayesian data analysis in R, topic modeling, which is an NLP uh, course. Hyperparameter tuning, which is an advanced machine learning terminology course. Bayesian regression modeling, this is uh, also a little bit advanced in, uh, in uh, math and statistics. Introduction to Spark, which is uh, big data in R. And that's it. There is no NLP. There is no big data. There is one only. There is only one big data. And in NLP, there is only topic modeling, but there is no introduction to NLP. And there is no network analysis. There is no deep learning. And there is no introduction to R and intermediate to R and statistics in R. And I mean, w w linear algebra in R and calculus in R. I mean, it's. It, it, there are there is a lot of courses are missing so right now i'm gonna give this uh, track so like two out of five but one thing you should know about data camp that these tracks i mean they should write it down here but i don't know why they didn't but this is not the perfect track if you are a complete beginner in order for you to become a machine learning scientist in r from data camp first thing you should do is you should go to data scientist with our career track and you take this track and you study it after you study this track then you go to machine learning scientist with our track let me tell you why in this track you can see that we have introduction to R, intermediate to R, and then we have introduction to tidyverse which was also there and we have some data manipulations there are a lot of data manipulation and data visualization courses here and it has some cleaning courses uh, cleaning data in in R and reporting an R markdown and fundamentals of machine learning and a stati statistics there is an EDA and there is an a statistics course in R so it will be the the perfect sense for you or the perfect uh, track for you is going to be you take this data scientist with R track first and then you go to the machine learning in R track and for the advanced courses there is no big data and there is no deep learning but there is NLP in R which is this course okay I don't know why it's not working but you guys can see here it's introduction to natural language processing in R 
okay it's working I mean it's it's there and uh, there is network analysis in R you can see that there is uh, no big data there there is no big data in R and there is no deep learning in R it's all in uh, Python and Keras Keras is Python also so the perfect sense for you going to be to take this first course the first track that the scientist with our track you can see the detailed review of this track on my uh, other video in this channel and after that you take the machine learning scientist with our track uh, it will be uh, much better this way and make sure to go to the project section and go to the filter projects and tell him that I want all the projects only in R and you can see that here you have a lot of projects some of them are guided some of them are guided and unguided the the difference between guided and unguided that guided is uh, uh, it's it's like an, an, an article you read it you understand it and then you apply it and the unguided is uh, the instructor himself is uh, explaining the project and writing and uh, giving you so the solution and you can also after you finish this uh, this uh <coughs> this project you can just download the notebook and upload it to your github so i would highly recommend that you guys uh, follow what i said first of all data science in, uh, in r and then machine learning in r and then you keep uh, uh, assessing your skills you can just go to the assessment section here and then after that you at the end you take these projects okay uh make sure to enroll to datacam from the link in the description below there is a big chance you're gonna get a uh, discount and enroll in the um, annual in the annual uh, subscription it's gonna be cheap and you'll be able to study everything here so thank you so much don't forget to like and subscribe share this video with your uh, friends and see you in the next video bye bye